Hi Earth Sign, welcome to my channel. We're doing your daily love soulmate relationship, October 3rd. Okay, for Tuesday. Okay, this is a uh, sun, moon, and rising. Sorry for the delay. We are still fixing the schedule. Okay, let's see what's going on. Okay, for the person you're connecting with, and then we'll see um, in an extended reading three crowning cards at the same time, and more of the of the situation that you are facing. Okay, so let's see what's going on with the Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. Okay. Let's see here, what's going on. Okay, so let's see here. You have here the world card, very positive energy because this is a, uh, you know, like you're starting new with someone, you're starting, um, when you start new, you end something also. You have to understand, right? So there was judgment before the world card. So there were big decision, big call for action that happened. Eight of Wands, communication, distance and travel. So this is, you know, whoever you're connecting with, you're really far from them. Like there's distance. Communication is happening from afar. It comes it comes and it brings you some a new sense of beginning, a new cycle. The communication brought you to a new new path. Page of Wands can be a fire sign. This communication from afar is about like how they are attracted towards you, how chemistry is there. Because it's the torch over here from what I'm sensing. The torch here brings the spark in the connection. Like you guys are so attracted from each attracted to each other. And someone here wants to use that as the beginning. Use that attraction to start something. Because it's going back and forth here that you know, like the connection. Let me see what's underneath the world card. Ace of Wands, total attraction over here. Magnetic attraction. Passion. Sex energy also. Desire. It's the world card is the you know a complete cycle and it starts here. It, the earth who you connect with, it starts with that flame inside you, that spark that you feel. And if it's completion, both of you feels this underneath the Eight of Wands, Ace of Cups. So you have fire and water over here in their chart. It's all about new beginnings in this energy, guys. Very, very good. Someone here is communicating about how they feel. And the other person here want, is allowing it or connecting with it because they feel the passion and desire with this person also. And then you have your Ten of Cups, guys. So, the Ace to the Ten over here is manifestation of, of the relationship. It jumps. It's a cycle. It completes. But it's how you want this connection to be. To, to, you know, it's almost like if you allow the energy just to start and don't, you know, and, you know, whatever was in the past with the judgment and all those stuff before the world card, letting it go the new beginning is here with this person you're connecting with water fire fixed signs also and it manifests to a connection but it really has to start either from just physical attraction when I mean, we all have that before it becomes to an emotional attraction This is a person who walks into your life. The ones is fire. They walk into your life fast. Eight of ones, like they communicate fast and then back and forth, back and forth. And then when, when that develops, it develops to a motion. And then from, from Ace of Cups, it develops to both being happy the way that you guys are connecting or communicating. The attraction brings joy to each other also. All right? So Earth Sign, I'm going to continue this reading. Thank you very much for watching. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Bye.